hiking among towering sandstone cliffs, meeting elusive animals on the way to culturally significant sites. Tourists are flocking to Carnarvon Gorge, 400 kilometres southwest of Rockhampton. It's just a place that we haven't been to, so we thought, why not? It's just amazing here. Numbers at peak periods have doubled over the past two years. With the lack of international travel brought about by COVID-19, we have seen the demand go through the, the roof. I reckon, yeah, this year's probably the busiest I've had it in the three years I've been here. Carnarvon Gorge Wilderness Lodge reopened in March, more than two years after bushfire destroyed parts of the property. But severe staff shortages have forced it to close the only restaurant on site. Trying to manage and uh, give the best service, but it's uh, definitely affecting the quality of the service, unfortunately. The gorge is an important part of the Bidjara and Gurringbal people's stories and cultures. I view Carnarvon as a huge cemetery. The Carnarvon Ranges, the whole sandstone belt. And um, for that reason, we, we have to carry a fairly high degree of reverence when we walk into those spaces. But there are fears the area is being loved to death. There's potential for those places to really deteriorate, given the high level of traffic into those visiting uh, those sites. Urging visitors to tread carefully. Erin Semler, ABC News, Carnarvon Gorge.